Okay, if you are planning to buy a laptop, either new or used, pay close attention to this video. Watch it till end because I'm going to show you some specific things you have to do before buying a laptop or you are already having a laptop but is not serving eight purpose for which you bought it for. Let me show you. Every laptop is manufactured to do a specific task. Whether you are an office worker, a web designer, a graphic designer, a video editor, a gamer, you have your specific laptop. So, first of all, check the specs of the laptop. When you, you are checking it, check the processor and there are letters attached to the description of the processor. That is the thing. That is what you should be looking for. So, we have Core i3, Core i5, Core i7, Core i9. I'm going to explain all these in the video. So, if you are ready, let's start. The first thing to do is check the specs of your machine. Okay, to check the specs of your laptop, go to your keyboard, press Windows X and tap Y twice. So this one will show, it will show like this. You can see here I have Intel R Core i7. You can see we have U here. This is what I meant. I meant. So pay attention to the letter here. Okay, some Intel core processors and their main factors. Now we are going to dive into it one after the other. Okay, now here are five Intel laptop processors suitable for browsing and office works. We have Intel i Core 7, Intel, we have Intel Core i7, 1165G7. Pay attention to the letters here. The, the letter G here. So this one is quad core and the speed is 2.8 gigahertz and the frequency is 4.7. These are low power laptop. It, is, it can only do this best. This is the best thing it can do. Office West browsing and some coding. Okay, we have another Intel Core i3-1115. You can see the gene is still here. This one too is dual core and 3.0 GHz and 4.1 GHz frequency. So, pay attention to the latest. Now we have you here. We have you here. As I showed you earlier, you can see my laptop was you. So it means it can only do best the best thing it can do is office works and browsing so if you want to use to do graphic design this is not a suitable laptop for that work you can see we have another you here again okay now let's move on and go to other other things here are five intel laptop processes suitable for graphic design other low power tasks so if you are a graphic designer this is the one you should buy. This is what will help you in your designing. So here we have Intel i7 and quad core. You can see the quad core. Look at the speed here, 4.7. The other ones were 4.1 and so we have you can see the H, the octa core, very powerful. You can see these ones are very good. You can do graphic designing. You can run almost all graphic design softwares you can see we have 80 here so now let's move to the other one you can see i've labeled i've highlighted the letters so this is very important look at it this is h the other one was gene and u okay let's go to the the most powerful here are five intel laptop processors suitable for gaming and video editing. These ones, you can see, this is the 11th generation, octa-core. 
look at the speed uh, frequency look at the speed okay this is where you should be looking 4.9 you can see the h is still here you can see the h and 2.3 5.1 frequency you can see these ones are very powerful laptops you can use it for any task you can see here the same thing 5.0 so now you know if you are buying a laptop this is what you should be looking for and the main thing is you should know what you are using it for so i hope it is clear now and if you found this video helpful please give us thumb up comment and also subscribe to my channel it will help me a lot thank you See you next time.